hello guys good morning good afternoon and good evening depends on your location at this time of the day this is news across nigeria today remains 11 day of march 2020 all right so uh, still on the issue of uh, osanusi the former emir of uh, kano state they dethroned and former emir of uh, kano state the update i have for you well just like uh, what people says uh, when one door closes, another door will open. So less than 24 hours after um, El Rufai appointed him into the board of Kaduna State Investment Promotion Authority, Governor El Rufai has named former Emir of uh, Kanu State, uh, Muhammad Sanusi II, as the Chancellor of Kaduna State University. Well, I really don't know what else would be a good news than this. You know, Sanusi is trending uh, globally as we are talking ever since he was dethroned as the Emir of Kano State. So, on behalf of the government and people of Kaduna State, Malam Nasa Erufai is delighted to appoint His Highness Muhammad Sanusi II as the Chancellor of the Kaduna State University. Erufai spokesman Muyuwa Adekeye said in a statement. In public life, His Highness has demonstrated a strong commitment to education. The Karuna state government has no doubt that a chancellor, His Highness Muhammad Osanusi, would provide symbolic and substantive leadership in raising the profile of Kasu as an emerging center of learning on the national and global level. Kano state government, uh, remember on Monday, removed Sanusi as Emir of uh, Kano, Kano Emirate, after six years on the throne. So, Secretary to the state government, Usman Alaji, said the former central bank governor was removed for his total disrespect to unlawful instruction from the office of the governor and other lawful authorities. So, Kano state government also announced Aminu Adu Bayero as the new area of Kano. So as I am talking to you, uh, there is um, some kind of bubble, more like a protest, uh, that is going on in the palace of uh, the new emir of uh, Kano state. All right. So um, while the news of Sanusi's removal was greeted with mixed reactions from Nigerians, Erufai showed faith in the former CBN governor by appointing into the board of the Karuna State Investment Promotion Authority less than 24 hours after his dethronement. So Sanusi's appointment come home as a mixed reaction, okay, moment for Kasu, which is transiting to the multi-campus structure with presence across the state. So uh, that was what Erufai said. Malam Nasa Erufai welcomed with gratitude the concern of His Highness Muhammad Sanusi to serve as a Chancellor of Kasu and as Vice, Chance Vice Chairman of the Board of Kadipa. The Kaduna State Government is grateful that Muhammad Sanusi too continues to support and assist the realization of the governance objectives of the Kaduna State Government. So Sanusi will succeed the Paunia Chancellor of Kasu, His Highness Malam Takwai Sambu, the Chief of Moros who was appointed to the role in 2005. All right, guys, um, that is another good news for Sanusi. Just like I said, when one door closes, another door will open. It's a common parable. Personally, um, I know a lot of people, uh, Nigerians, will want to see this Erufai's um, action as uh, another awareness against uh, 2023 uh, presidency all right uh, but let us forget about politics aspect to be frank me like i said um nigeria we love to politicize everything but when we sh we see issues like this we should try to analyze it on the other way around okay number one if samusi was not removed or was not dethroned every five wouldn't have you know giving him this appointment and if you are looking at it every five um, as if you knew the mind of other northern northern elders 
or other northern governor that Sanusi with his intellect with his intellect everyone knows what that man is carrying so or maybe because he, he, he speaks the truth and for this period in time believe me uh, uh, PDP uh, good luck Jonathan loyalist you know they everybody saying it's a uh, it's karma and nemesis that is catching up on Sanusi that he was raising um, false alarm during good luck Jonathan administration uh, that it is the same nemesis that is catching up on him but actually I may not see it in that way round okay I may not see it like that so what the uh, Erufa is doing for me people will say it is um, an agenda for his 2023 20, presidential ambition but no he knows what he is doing i'm talking about erufai he knows what he is doing that sanusi is an asset leaving him like that it's gonna be waste okay so he had this ideology before anyone could appoint him into some because certainly some northern governor will want to work with sanusi all right some northern governor they will love to work with sanusi so uh, that is the reason for my own point of view so I don't know what you guys uh, think but if you have anything contrary to my own opinion you can put it down in the comment section below but for my own point of view Erufai knows uh, what Sanusi carries upstairs talking about upstairs he knows what Sanusi is carrying upstairs so he's trying to you know make sure that he is working with such person but you may say it because of his 2023 presidential ambition i really don't care that is my own personal opinion all i wanted to do was to give you the good news okay for me it is a good news that erufai named sanusi as a chancellor of kaduna state university let me know what you think on the comment section below do you think it's um, an agenda for erufai against 2023 election or he really wants to work with sanusi to achieve what he needs to achieve for the people of Kaduna. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe. It is free. Please, part of your effort to support us. At least I am begging. All right? It is free. So subscribe. Make sure you click on the bell icon so you get instant notification whenever we have stories like this to share with you guys. And you'll be the first to get the story. See you guys in another video.